most of these uh, figures except for these two. Uh, I got these two from GameStop when Heart Gold and Soul Silver came out. Whenever you got the game, they would give you this little figurine to go along with the game. So, yeah, that's how I got these two. So, let's take a look at these two first. So, we got Of 
I have a commute to I as well. Uh, I actually think I prefer my commute to Y over my commute to X. Especially in the games, because I think um, Mewtwo is like a special attacker, and when it Mega Evolves into Mega Mewtwo Y, its special attack increases, so making it even stronger. Whereas I think Mega Mewtwo X kind of becomes a physical attacker. So yeah, Mega Mewtwo Y is better. <laughs> Mega Evolutions, got Mega Charizard X, Zoko with the Blue Flames, although I can, again, with, uh, I think the same thing with, like, Mewtwo's, where Charizard is a special attacker, and when it evolves into Mega Charizard X, um, it becomes a physical attacker instead. I also have Xerneas. Um, I think with X and Y, I had the Y version, so this was the um, the legendary that I had. I didn't, I didn't get to use Xerneas, but um, yeah, I think it looks pretty cool as well.
Dragonite, and it's just it's like so different from its previous evolutions. It's just then all happened. It's not to say Dragonite is a bad Pokemon. It's, it looks decent enough, but it's just not how I, how I would have thought uh, Dragonair's evolution would look like. It would be. But yeah, there you go. Um, next we got. I think his name. Shadow. Um, it's a pretty cool Pokemon, I guess. It looks kind of cool. Uh, I like the, um, like his little eyebrows are kind of like his little flames or something. Um, I never really got to use him in the games. I actually don't even know what uh, generation he's from. After that, was it Sword and Shield? I think. But um, now, next we got Mega Gyarados. Uh, and I'm gonna be honest, I actually don't really like the way Mega Gyarados. Looks kind of like too similar to regular Gyarados, and like really the only major difference are like these wing sails, I think. And he's like a little bit more chubbier, I guess. But I don't know. I would have liked to see like more of a difference from Mega Gyarados compared to regular Gyarados. Also have shiny Mega Gyarados. <laughs> yep. So again, same thing. Just he's red. The shiny version of him. Uh, yep. There he is compared to the regular Mega Gyarados. Alright. Next. It's like Tapu Coco or something like that. Um, there's some other Pokemon. I guess like the trio or whatever that he's part of. They have similar names. And so I just, I, I don't know the difference. I think there's like Tapu Coco, which I think is this one. Then there's like Tapu Lele. And then Tapu Nanu or some shit like that. from Sun and Moon, and I just, I never really got into those games, uh, I, I didn't really like them that much, but uh, yeah, he's pretty cool, I guess, he got like this giant ass mohawk, <laughs> um, yeah, there he is, there we go, next, Is. I think both Megalodios and Megalodius look the same. So this could be either or. Uh, I think it looks pretty cool. I guess. Um, cool. And again, he's got um, this little cloud stand. And it's just kind of, kind of in a flying pose. We got Sylvani, I think this is his name. Again, I think he's from like Sun and Moon, and I just, I never really got into those games. I just found them long and boring. Um, definitely, probably my least favorite generation. 
しversions. <laughs> 